think you know how a hip fracture is fixed? Prepare to have your understanding unhinged. The dynamic hip screw, widely used and trusted, isn't just a rigid implant. It's an engineering marvel. Welcome to Ortho Implants for Life, your one-stop destination for all orthopedic implant industry-related information. Today, we uncover the hidden hinge mechanism behind its controlled compression and why it matters. Disclaimer. Again, remember that this video is for education only and not medical advice. Always consult a qualified orthopedic specialist for clinical decisions. So, let's dive in. The Real World Setup Picture an elderly patient who falls at home, suffering an intertrochanteric hip fracture. The surgeon opts for a dynamic hip screw, or DHS. From the outside, it looks like a screw attached to a plate, a common solution. Yet there's more beneath the surface. Next, the hinge revealed. The secret lies in the DHS design. The lag screw sits inside a barrel on the side plate, allowing it to slide along the femoral neck's axis. Think of it like a door hinge. It slides under load, permitting controlled movement and fracture compression, which accelerates healing. This isn't instability, it's precision engineered motion. Now, why the hinge matters? Without that hinge like sliding, the implant behaves rigidly, leading to complications like stress shielding or screw pullout. Clinical and biomechanical studies confirm that load sharing between bone and implant improves outcomes and reduces fixation failure in stable trochanteric fractures. Conversely, if the lag screw can't slide due to improper barrel selection or mechanical blockage like a blocked barrel or over-rigid augmentation, it can break or fail. Now let's bust common myths. If the screw moves, it must be failing. In truth, Controlled sliding is a core feature, not a flaw. Avoid novices removing impaction bars or over-tightening plate screws, which can block sliding and compromise healing. Real-world biomechanics and outcomes. Biomechanical tests demonstrate that a DHS blade, especially in osteoporotic bone, outperforms screws in resisting cutout due to its bone compaction and rotational stability. Clinical reports show complications arise when barrel length impinges on fracture or homemade trochanteric stabilization plates block sliding, leading to non-union or hardware breakage. The DHS legacy and future influence The DHS hinge concept isn't just history, it informs today's implant innovation. From sliding hip screws to smart compression implants and load sharing designs, biomechanics continues evolving. The DHS remains foundational in emerging markets and low resource settings due to its effective simplicity and years of clinical data. An implant isn't just a screw. It's a biomechanical partner in healing. So next time you hear dynamic hip screw, remember it's more than just a screw. It's dynamic. A hinge mechanism that unlocks controlled motion supports load sharing and promotes bone healing. If you have enjoyed the video, like it, share it and if you are new to our channel, subscribe it. Hit the bell icon to get notifications for all our upcoming videos. Join us to excel in this orthopedic implant industry and to know more about the job and career growth which is available in this industry. Thank you. See you again next week.